What's up everyone, today I'm gonna teach you how to draw J-Hope from BTS official figurines. If you are new to this channel, be sure to like, subscribe and comment below. I'm gonna draw on my welcome tablet, but you can follow through my tutorial with any other media that you have, whether it's pencil color, sharpie or crayons. So I'm gonna begin with drawing his hair first. So we're gonna take the center point above his hairline here and draw a curve line downwards and then turn it sideways to the left then I'm gonna make a sharp turn back to the right and go back up at the corner and up and then at this side I'm gonna draw a curve line to the right side of his face and then make a sharp turn back up and then we're gonna add another strands of hair at this corner here similar shape to the one we done earlier and then at the side of the head I'm gonna draw a curve line there and then make a sharp turn down and then another sharp turn back up at the corner and then from this point over here and draw a curve line outwards and then make a sharp turn back up and to the center above the head right there and down now going back to the center of the forehead above the hairline I'll draw a line across right there where the hairline is and I can extend it a bit further to the left and then slightly above that ending point I'm gonna draw from this point here a curve line down and then turn it to the left and stop there and then slightly above at this corner here I'm gonna draw a curve line down and to the side and below that here at this point I draw a curve line to the left side of the head and then I'm gonna make a sharp turn back up to the side and then another strand of hair at this corner here with a curve line down and then sharp turn back up and then at the side here, I'm going to draw a curve line one and then another one above it and extend it all the way up and turn it to the center above it and then at this corner here, I'm going to draw a curve line outwards and slightly downwards at the tip there and then make a sharp turn back and then I'm gonna extend that line to the side above and stop there and then from this point here I'm gonna draw a curve line to the center hit there and then at this point here I'm gonna add a short curve line like that and then for the center of the hair I'm gonna draw a line across to the back like that Now on the right side of the hair, we're going to add the sideburns from this point down and turn it back up. Now I'm going to draw his face shape from the left sideburn here. Curve line down and turn it to the center. The same on this side. Now I'm gonna draw his face shape. So I'm gonna take from the point below his left sideburn here and draw a curve line down and turn it to the center 
and leave a gap between for his finger along the the cheek there on the left and then I'm gonna continue this to the chin across to the right then I'm gonna get leave another gap at that point over there and continue that to the right side of the face and then for his ears I'm just gonna add a semicircle up there and then extend it down and semicircle at the bottom and the same goes to the right side here as well so inside of that on the upper section we're gonna trace that same shape and then midway down I'm gonna turn it outwards and make a turn back in I'm gonna do the same thing on the left side there now I'm gonna draw his um, eyeglass so I'm gonna take from this point at the side curve line there and extend it to the center and slightly downwards as you go to the center and then turn it the way around at the mid section and then go back to the sideways then we're gonna turn that downwards at the corner here and at that corner we're not gonna turn it back in and slightly upwards as you reach the center part of the eye and turn it slightly towards back to the right at the top portion there we are gonna do the same thing on the left side of the glasses and for the lower part of this I'm just gonna trace that same shape above and for the inner line we're just gonna trace that whole thing inside in the in in this section there And then above the glass, I'm gonna add his eyebrow with a curved line from the center to the side and another line above that, like that. I'm gonna do the similar shape on the left side here. And then for his eyes, I'm going to draw a curved line from this corner of the eye, the glasses, to the side of the corner above the eye. Then I'm going to turn it downwards at this corner. And from the inner corner of the eye, I'm going to create another curve line there to the center of the upper part and I'm going to thicken that as you go to the center of the eye all the way to the back and that corner as well there and the lower part of the eye, I'm going to add a curved line across. And for his pupils, we're going to add a semi 
a circle like that and a small white circle at this top portion of the eye and then for the center I'm gonna add a black circle right there now we're gonna repeat the whole process for his uh, left eye Now we're gonna add his mouth below the glasses from the left point here. I'm gonna draw across a curve line. And then we're gonna add a tiny nose in the middle there. Like that. And then for his fingers, so I'm gonna take the side of a palm here and draw a circle, semicircle across and then I'm gonna turn that with a semicircle downwards at that corner there and make a turn down and then make a semicircle back up at the bottom and curl it up at the side. And I'm gonna add some more fingers here and here and then one pointing to the face so we're gonna do a curve line up to the face and make a semicircle turn down back to that finger and for his thumb from this point here I'm gonna turn it to the side and make a semicircle back turn I'm going to repeat the same process on for the right finger here. And then around the the wrist I'm gonna draw a circle like that and another one outside of that and we're gonna stop as you reach the this corner here and make a turn sideways right be below the arm and to the side of his waist I'm gonna do the same thing on the right side here and then it, I'm gonna add two folding line folding curve at the side here and the same goes to the right side 
and below that I'm gonna draw across a curved line and at the sides I'm gonna add a short line and below that we're gonna draw across a line again and we're gonna repeat that one more time below and at the side I'm gonna draw a curved line downwards out and then back in and then I'm gonna repeat that on the right side here and then at the center of his pants I'm gonna draw across a short curve line there and off center I'm gonna draw a curve line to his knee and then turn it back to the center as you go down and then at the bottom I'm gonna draw across a curve line and on both sides of that I'm gonna draw a short line there and another curve line across at the bottom and for his shoes I'm gonna draw a curve line to the front of the shoes and a short curve line to the heels I'm gonna connect those two together across with a curve line and another curve line above it and then in front of the shoes we're gonna draw a curve line to the side like that so I'm gonna repeat the whole thing on the right side as well And going back to his outfit below the neck, I'm gonna add a, a um, diagonal line from the side here to the center below on both sides. And then from the center point of each line, I'm gonna draw another diagonal line to the opposite direction and turn it up at the side of the face. And I'm gonna repeat that on the right side there as well and below this center point I'm going to draw across a curved line and another below that and at the side of the cheek we're going to add a line there like that and that's all for our tutorial today I hope you enjoy the lesson and find my videos helpful. Be sure to like and subscribe to this channel. Also, feel free to let me know of your requests, suggestions, or any other comments in the comment section below.